When you walk into the classroom, you're not there to teach curriculum. You're there to teach kids. And every day, you're looking at the 20 to 30 kids in your classroom, and you're thinking to yourself, how can I reach that kid? What can I do to motivate, inspire, educate, promote this particular child? And then of us as teachers and us as educators creating programs that are enticing for them. And you know, there were a lot of songs I couldn't reach notes up, and he took the time and worked with me um, over and over <laughs> for hours. Um, but he, you know, he knew I could do it. So that belief that whatever it took. If a student um, really is interested in something, it drives them to really work hard there. The caring, that these teachers really do care about every student that's in their classroom. They really care how they present material to them because they know how they need to learn, whether they're visual or whether they do better hands-on. They know those kind of things. They do differential teaching and they just know that. I think when you step into a classroom, the thing that magic for me is that you see bright smiling faces, kids that are enjoying their day, they're having a great day at school. If you like people, and I really do love students, you know, and I love music, I think it's just, it's kind of just been a natural fit for me. I always feel like, in a way, each one of my classes becomes a little bit like a family throughout the course of the year because we're working together every day to, the, and the goal is always obviously to learn more language than we came in with that day, but because we're just trying to use Spanish to talk about our lives and the things that are going on in the world around us, we end up finding out a lot about each other. And so I feel like I really get to know my students. That, that's just inspiring to me. The fact that he can completely transform my education from being in the gutters to on par with all my peers. Not really a teacher. He's more of like a friend that like you learn stuff off of. Like you, un not in unintentionally, but you don't real when you step into his class, you don't realize that you are learning. You just kind of like take in all this knowledge and stuff and then you turn it into your own. I love helping other people uh, get to that same place where they can understand something that was mysterious. So, I don't know, I guess I'm just an educator because I was born that way. Kids often ask me, Mrs. Sonnenberg, why do you get so excited during a math lesson? And I tell them, because when you get something in math, you've made the connection and you've made it your own. And that is the way it is with everything in life. To you teachers, I would like to say that as parents, we really do appreciate the time, the effort, the extra resources that you put into our students. The role that you have in our children's lives is going to make a huge difference in the people that they become. Thank you so much.